Simon. You got a pen. Ah. Uh, sorry, kid. It's gonna be as cold as a warlock's ball sack. It's like he was hanging his ball sack above you and dragging it right across your forearm. There you go. Give you a little leverage. doing shit. Ah, oh, Rick, I want you to take your axe. Cut your son's left arm off, right on that line. Yeah, I know, I know. You're gonna have to process that for a second. That makes sense. Still, though, I'm gonna need you to do it, or all these people are gonna die. Then Carl dies, then the people back home die. And then you, eventually. Let yeah. me keep you breathing for a few years just so you can stew on it. You, you don't have to do this. We understand. We understand. You understand? Yeah. I'm not sure that Rick does. I want to need a clean cut right there on that line. Now, I know this is a screwed up thing to ask, but it's going to have to be like a salami slice. Nothing messy, clean, 45 degrees. Give us something to fold over. We got a great doctor. The kid will be fine. Probably. Rick. This needs to happen now. Chop, chop. Or I will crush the little fella's skull myself. It can, it can, it can be me. It can be me. What, what? You can do it to me. I, I can go with with you. No. This is the only way. Rick, pick up the axe. Not making a decision is a big decision. You really want to see all these people die? You will. You will see every ugly thing. Oh, my God. Are you going to make me count? Okay, Rick. You win. I am counting. Three! Please. Please. It could be me. Please. Two! Please don't do it. This is it. You answer to me. You provide for me. You belong to me. Right? Speak what you're spoken to! You answer to me. You provide for me. I provide for you. You belong to me. Right? Right. That is the look I wanted to see. We did it. All of us.